We've got all our experimental uh, equipment and supplies set up, so now we can start uh, going ahead with starting things. I'm going to start with my wheatgrass here, and just a quick recap. I've got each of my individual cell packs here already with soil. It's watered, even though I'll give it more water when we get to that stage. Each of my cell packs has on the side a label saying how much seed I'm going to put into each of the cell packs, and I've got my scale here. Now one of the challenges with this is uh, we're looking at 6.2, 7.4 grams, and my scale does, is not quite that fine. And so what I am going to have to do is a little bit of estimating here. I don't have a super high-end scale. And because these are actually small amounts of seed, uh, the measuring is a little bit tedious. But what I'm trying to do is just do it in little sections. So here where I'm looking at 7.4, what I'm trying to do is make sure I don't go over and make sure I've got more that's in uh, my previous jar. So what I'm doing is looking for when it hits seven and then putting in a few extra seeds. And as long as I'm consistent with that, I can get a good sense of um, what, um, of being consistent. And I can tell by the number of seeds in there, we're probably at about 0.1 gram per seed. So it makes it fairly easy in that regard. So I did my 6.2 a moment ago. Here's my 7.4. And I'm gonna do my 8.7 gram. Now, each time I put a new uh, container on here, I need to tear the scale to make sure it's uh, balanced. So I'm not including that in things. This is 8.7, so I'm just adding seed as I go. Watching, so it's just hit eight. A little off, seven, eight. It's a little tricky, it kind of goes back and forth a bit. Now I'm up at eight. I'm trying to do a little bit of a comparison there, and I can see like the density just in the bottom there. It's definitely more. All right, so I'm gonna go with that. So that's our 8.7. So then I've got 9.9, 11.2. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to continue to go through this. I'm gonna do all my jars and just let them sit on top here. I'm gonna grab my second tray. I'm gonna do the same thing again because we're doing replicates. Then I'm going to add my water and then the time begins. And then I basically got an hour of soak time before I drain these seeds and then, and then do the sowing. So I'm gonna do that so you don't have to watch that and then we'll come back uh, and take a look at the watering stage.